You ever have one of those days where you're really tired, but you're also just amped up because you're excited? That's today for me. I just released my phrase beginner to master course, and I'm really excited about it because I've spent months on this thing and I've actually recorded it twice and uh, it's better than it was before. I, I'm really excited about it. I, I had to re-record it all because the phrase UI changed, but I think it's, it's for the better. So who's this course for? If you have a subscription to phrase and you're, you're still juggling between multiple tools and you're really not sure what to do in terms of creating content to rank, then this course is for you. In my opinion, and if you watch any of my videos, you'll know I love Phrase. I don't love Phrase for no reason. I, I love Phrase because Phrase is legitimately awesome. It is, in my opinion, the hrefs of SEO writing tools. After you have your keyword from SEMrush or hrefs, I use Phrase. You use Phrase to put that in, and that will get you from keyword to ranked content, You know, depending on the competition and depending on how good of a job you do. But it's really all you need after you have your keyword that you want to write about. It will handle your research. It will, you can go to the SERP, you can look at the competitors, you can pull stuff in for competitive keywords and make sure you're talking about all the right concepts. You can uh, look at questions from people also ask, from the SERP, from Quora, from Reddit. You can go to Wikipedia and pull in more stuff that the SERP's not even talking about. You name it, Phrase does it. So this course, it's over six hours of content right now, of videos. And I wanna add three or four more hours to this and I mean, I'd like to keep adding even more. I wanna make this the definitive course on Phrase because Phrase, in my opinion, is just that good. Here is the course right here. Here's what I have right now. And it's under early bird pricing because the course isn't quite complete yet. I wanna add a couple more hours. And when I do that, I'm gonna disable the early bird pricing and it's gonna to go to the full price. Uh, probably 149, I'm not quite sure yet. So here are the different modules. The documents module, this is where you spend 90% of your time in Phrase. We're going to talk about how to how to make a document then we'll talk about content briefs when you should be using them why you should you should be using them we're going to do an seo primer seo starts with the serp and i really want to talk about that and help because i don't know i don't know who you are or where you're from or what your your level is maybe you want a side hustle maybe you want to create a website and you know nothing about seo or creating content or ranking content don't worry i got you Maybe you know a little bit about SEO, but you're a little bit shaky. Well, this is the, the lesson for you. I'm gonna explain some concepts that are very important so that you can use Phrase properly because Phrase is an SEO tool. Then we're gonna jump into the research component. There's a couple different lessons here. The SERP overview, headings, questions, external links, statistics, news, and Wikipedia. Those are all in the research component. They're all very important and I think they're glossed over by a lot of users. There's a lot of tips and tricks I share in here that you probably don't know about. Then we have the outline functionality, which just got an upgrade and it's freaking amazing now. And the optimize functionality so that you can take your content after you've written it and get it to like max optimization so that you're doing everything on page possible to rank. And, then, and this is what sets Phrase apart from other, other AI tools and even other SEO tools, but mainly AI tools. A lot of people will use these AI tools and they'll, they'll just create articles, but those articles won't rank for competitive keywords. Phrase is not an AI tool. It's an SEO tool with AI added on. The main functionality of Phrase is not AI. It's, it's writing content that's gonna rank and AI is just icing on the cake. But a lot of people miss all that. So then we're gonna jump into the AI. Now the AI in Phrase is different from the AI in other tools. And, and this is lost on so many people. So many people come from these other tools where they're clicking the right for me, right for me, right for me. And that's not how you use the AI in Phrase. But I will show you how to use the AI like that in Phrase properly. And I bet you don't know what I'm gonna share with you. Then after that, I'm gonna open up some of my custom templates and show you some of the code for, for some of these templates and go through the process of creating temp a custom template, but also improving like my thought process as I improve some of these custom templates. We're gonna look at the listicle with paragraphs template. It's been used over 17,000 times. Very, very popular template. I'm gonna show you some of the code for that. And we're gonna do listicle with paragraphs, next paragraph, and then write a product recommendation. One of these, we're gonna take it to a next version. I don't know which one that is, I forget. But we're gonna look at the code for all three of these templates. And I'll talk about my thought process as I created them and as I improved them. And hopefully that's going to lay the foundation 
so that you can start creating your own custom templates. Because Phrase has a leg up on, on everybody else. The, the power of the AI lies in these templates. And then finally, we're gonna have a writing module. Uh, right now I have one uh, lesson in here, write a, a listicle, but I wanna have a couple lessons in here where I, where I write different formats of articles. I wanna do a, a product review roundup article next, where I'm gonna like review a bunch of products from Amazon, show you how I would write that article. I wanna have a couple of these things in here, maybe like a frequently asked questions article, some other things like that. And then eventually we're going to have a, a module in here for uh, the SEO tools, such as the analytics and stuff like that. The analytics and phrase is amazing. It's much better than uh, Google Search Console. So that's the course. I'm really excited about it. There really is a lot of value in here. I put a lot of time in here. I really hope you like it. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. I have a link to the course in the, in the description below. If you don't have phrase, I'll also have a link to that in the description. Um, I'm excited. I hope you are too. This is, this is honestly a good course. I really am impressed with it. And if you want to level up your phrase skills to that master level, this is all you need.